Hi friends, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to share with you my September Azure Standard Hall. If you're unfamiliar with Azure Standard, it is a place where you can go and buy bulk items, you can buy organic food, it's, it's all sorts of things, actually buckets and sometimes seeds and plants sometimes, sometimes of year. And you order once a month and they deliver all of the items to one central drop location. So you're not paying for shipping to your home. Um, a lot of times we'll order like bulk pantry staples that are super heavy and you don't wanna ship those to your home, wheat berries and things like that because that gets super expensive. But with Azure, we can order those, have great organic options and bulk options. And we can just go once a month to our drop location, which is really close and pick it up. This is great for us, especially because we live in a rural area. And so it's really hard. It's limiting on our food options. You know, the closest Costco is two hours away and um, Whole Foods, you know, to get some good healthy food, it's, it's a two hour drive. And this allows us to save that time and that money and gas. And a lot of times Azure's prices are super comparable, especially when you're buying in bulk. So I'm gonna share with you what we bought this month with Azure. And as usual, I just kind of add it to the cart <laughs> until we hit our budget. And so I don't ever really remember what, what all we have. So it'll be exciting and an adventure for me too. This, let's see, these, I'm pretty sure it is what's in the box. Most of these are not what's in the box, but I'm pretty sure this is. <clears throat> yes. This is frozen French fries. We love, they have a lot of frozen convenience foods that are bagged up in resealable bags that you can just open, pull some out. So when we're doing easy hamburger night or whatever, we can pull out French fries, we can season them like we want. They don't have all the extra additives, it's just potatoes. So we can season these up and they're delicious. And this is one of those staples we just always keep on hand for quick and easy nights. And in the same vein, I know what these are. These are cubed potatoes and they are wonderful. The more you buy, the bigger bulk size you buy, the cheaper they are, they're frozen and they're already cubed for you. So you can do all sorts of things with them. You can eat them like hash browns or you can go ahead and heat them up really quick to mash them. It just makes it super convenient to have things like this um, on hand. Now we do, you've seen us do, if you've been around a while, we do a lot of canning. We'll buy potatoes in bulk and we skin them and we can them and I love having canned potatoes on the shelf or we'll you know, cook on our own, but having some pre-cubed just makes your life easier. I love these as a convenience food. They also have um, mixed veggies that we love to have in our freezer. Right now we didn't need them because we just put a bunch of veggies away, but these frozen things that you can just open the top on and scoop out, we love to have their berries and things like that. They're a great staple to have on hand. All right, let's see what's in here. These are grapes. I haven't tried their grapes before, but we absolutely love their produce. They are, their produce is just top notch delicious. And so I thought we would try their grapes and see how they work. So these are the flame seedless grapes. I have tried the flame raisins and the flame raisins are absolutely delicious. So I'm excited to try the grapes. All right, more frozen stuff for us. I said I liked the mixed veggies because you can scoop and go. This is gonna be the first time we've tried the frozen broccoli, but the same concept. We're making a meal. If maybe a couple of us are home and a couple are out, you can get just however much you need. And this goes a long way, these big bags of frozen veggies. It's really nice to be able to grab them and go. 
And I will say this for their produce, it's delicious, it is flavorful, and it's healthy and organic, and it's huge. If you watched one of our last canning videos, I showed you the comparison. I had bought some onions at Walmart because I didn't have enough of my Azure onions to finish the project, and the size difference was just massive, and the taste difference is really enormous as well. You know how when you grow your own vegetables, they just taste better, they taste more flavorful because you've let them ripen and you know all of the things that go into them. It's the same with the organic um, produce from Azure. It is really delicious. And that's one of the reasons we love them is because I've, I've gotten a chance to actually talk to the owner and he is so committed to providing super healthy food and that's just his passion. And I love that I can trust the things that I buy, that he has done the legwork and really has some high standards for the kind of food that he sells. And so if you're curious about that, you can read on their website. They have all the guidelines for how they choose foods. And they have before in the past stopped carrying certain foods and certain suppliers when they go outside of those bounds. So they're pretty strict with that, which I appreciate because then that takes some of the legwork off of what I have to do. And if you've been around our channel for a while, you know one of the things we've been doing over the past year or so is really trying to focus and get back to more whole, healthy eating. And this has really helped us, I say, as I pull this out of the <laughs> Sometimes you do need some snacks and convenience foods. I don't know why, but this is chocolate chip cookie dough and I thought we would try their chocolate chip cookie dough. It's all organic ingredients and I've heard some really great things and I just thought this might be a fun treat to have on hand. So we'll give it a try. This probably isn't gonna be something we add very often um, because it's not necessarily a staple, but I just thought this would be a fun thing for the kids. We've got some more brown basmati rice. This is my favorite. Uh, we've been trying, again, to get to more whole grains, more brown rice, and the brown basmati rice, when I did my research, has like the lowest chance of holding arsenic because of where it's grown. So we started getting brown basmati rice and we love it. We cook it with a little bit more water than the white rice, but it turns out really delicious. I eventually would like to get a bigger bag of it, but you know, if you've been on this journey with us, we've been slowly buying bulk when we can afford to buy bulk. And then eventually, hopefully, we'll be caught up to where we're buying one or two things in bulk every time. The ketchup. I have really, really loved Azure's ketchup. Uh, my husband doesn't, but that's fine. He tolerates it. <laughs> but if you've paid attention to the sugar content and like Heinz ketchup and stuff, it is massive. There's so much sugar in ketchup. And this ketchup has three grams of sugar per serving, which is way lower than most other ketchups. And so we've really enjoyed this ketchup. Eventually, I would like to make my own ketchup. So if you have a good ketchup recipe, link that down below or give us a comment with it because I would love to start doing that. We've just had to kind of slowly ease into some of these things. You can't just jump in all at once <laughs> or you get burned out. And, you know, this is in all of our boxes. These are the instant mashed potatoes for my daughter, Taylor. <laughs> so she loves instant mashed potatoes. This is very potato-y load. We have a lot of potatoes. <laughs> um, she just said it's because potatoes are the best. Potatoes are fun. But these are great and super easy, ready to go. And they don't have the same kind of fillers and fake ingredients that some of the ones on the shelf have at the grocery store. <laughs> You're gonna laugh at me even harder now. <laughs> I said this was a potato -y load. I said I add stuff and I don't really pay attention. This is really a potato -y load because look, I even got five pounds of potatoes, just regular potatoes. So we'll have potato potatoes. But the, we'll eat the potatoes first. The thing with the frozen ones and the dehydrated mashed potatoes and some mashed potatoes is that those will last in the shelf for months and months and months. So it doesn't, we don't have to worry about using those right away. We can eat the fresh ones. Here we have our raw orange blossom honey. This is our favorite tasting honey 
of the honeys they sell, um, at least that we've tried. There are a few that we might not have tried, but we love this and we make bread and we use this in our baked goods and bread. And olive oil. Now, olive oil is crazy expensive. <sighs> and anywhere you go, it's if you get real cold pressed olive oil, it is expensive. And one of the reasons why I really love and I'm thankful to order olive oil here because a lot of the olive oils on the grocery shelf can be cut with a certain percentage of vegetable oil and still be able to be labeled as olive oil. And I know that he does not allow that in his olive oil and the Azure Standard olive oil, it is pure olive oil. So I know what I'm getting and I really appreciate that. So olive oil. I've got some ginger, cold and flu season is coming up and it's always good to have ginger on the shelf ready to go. You can make teas with it. Um, we can make some dumplings. dumplings apparently. Taylor's off screen like yelling things at me. <laughs> we can make dumplings with it. We can make all sorts of things with ginger. So we've got some ginger ready to go. Onions. We always get the onions. The onions are big, the onions are beautiful, the onions are tasty, and the onions last a really long time. And I decided to try some celery. I don't know that I've tried the, I think I have tried their celery in a mixed box. We used to get those big mixed box of veggies. Um, we'll do that every once in a while. We'll probably do some again this winter. But I went ahead and got some celery because, you know, it's starting to get fall out, soup making time. It's good to have celery in there. This is one of those fantastic things that I love, love, love from Azure. This is Rumano butter. This butter is delicious. So it is um, European style grass fed butter. And even if I go, like we have Brahms here and they have some fairly good European style butter, but the difference is pretty marked in this Rumano butter. It's so delicious. So we love to stock up on the Romano butter when we can. All right, a couple things left. We've got navy beans here. In the Everbit Counts Challenge, I canned for the first time uh, baked beans. And it was fairly easy and they were really delicious. We've already eaten a couple jars of them. And I had no idea until then that actually baked beans are made from white navy beans. So I thought, hey, let's get a bunch of white navy beans. Uh, beans are one of the cheap things you can buy in bulk and have in store for a long time. It'll be great to be able to make some of that, some more of that. And then some organic cane sugar. This is just a great, another bulk buy for the baking season that's coming upon us. And last but not least is their October sales flyer, which I'll go through. This is, I usually try to spend, um, my budget is usually around $200 a month for Azure. And sometimes that ebbs and flows depending on where we spend the rest of our grocery budget. But we really try to consistently do $200 at Azure. And um, this is probably right around that. And if you've been to the grocery store lately, you know. that <laughs> That's a pretty good deal. <laughs> Especially for good, whole organic foods that are going to go a long way to feeding our family. So we're, we're pretty excited. Uh, we do this once a month and we do a butcher box once a month. And if you're interested in our butcher box unboxings, we, we really haven't, we, we did one, the first butcher box we got and kind of talked about it a little bit. But if you're interested in seeing some of those, let me know and I can do those, but I in the past haven't really done butcher box unboxings monthly, but we've really been trying to do an Azure standard order for whole ingredients and a butcher box order for our meats. And then obviously we've got deer in the free fridge and Lance got a wild hog this year and we've got eggs and things. So we've been really trying between those things to minimize our trips to like Walmart. And we've been trying to do once a month going to Walmart and getting some staples like uh, our toiletries and things like that. And it's really saved us money and it's saved us from eating a lot of junk that we normally would just grab and throw in the buggy at Walmart. So this has been 
Um, this has been really good and we've loved Azure Standard. I would love to hear your favorite things from Azure Standard. That's always, I always find some new things in the comments when y'all leave, ooh, I get this or this is my favorite or whatever. I always love to find the new things because like if you go to their website, it's just massive. There's so much stuff and it takes a while to figure out, okay, this is a really good value. This is what I wanna buy. And so it takes a while to figure out your, your staples. So I love to hear other people's staples and what they buy at Azure Standard. So thank you so much for joining us. Y'all have a wonderful day.